Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be filming a finals night routine. So I just finished my last class of the day. It is 2.35, so today I had late start. Um, but anyways, right now I'm going to relax for a little bit before I start my homework, studying, all of that. So actually first, I'm just going to clean up a little bit. I have this notebook that's out from my last class, random like stuff everywhere. So I'm just going to go ahead and put that away. Also, we got this really cool tree skirt. So this gives it like a little bit like of a pop to the bottom, kind of that industrial farmhouse kind of feel. And I think it looks really, really cute. Literally yesterday, I thought a package was stolen out of our yard because my mom was supposed to get one of my Christmas presents. Literally, I accidentally spoiled it for myself. You'll get to that later though. And she was like, oh, it didn't arrive. Later, I go to your orders and then I click on, I click on the thing she ordered, which shoot, there were shoes for me. And then I saw the picture that the Amazon worker had attached because basically when Amazon drops off your packages, they usually like take a picture um, of the package sitting by the doorstep. And I was like, oh my gosh, someone stole our package. And our neighborhood is pretty safe, but there has been some package stealing happening. And I'm like, someone stole my shoes. Like I'm so angry. And I was like thinking about it and this morning. I was like, ugh. And then I showed my dad the picture again. We were like, hey, actually, that's not even our house. That is not the mat in, in front of our house. So I was like, oh my gosh, it just got delivered to the wrong location and it wasn't actually stolen. So that's very good. Okay, so there's been some updates since I talked to you guys last. In the last clip, I was talking about our package situation and how we thought our package got stolen off of our porch, but actually it was at our neighbor's house, but we just didn't know which neighbor. We could only see like half of the little mat and like the color of the house in the picture. So we like weren't quite sure. Um, but then the neighbor came and was like, and like returned it. It's, there was like a kind of a confusing story to go along with it. But basically we got the package. That's all that matters. Um, but I just lit a really good smelling candle. It's like a gingerbread kind of candle from Target. They were only $5 and they're super, super cute. Like very aesthetic. I have to do, I'm actually going to highlight because that's fun. Um, I have to do practice for Spanish. I'm going to do that last because like I don't really have to do it. I just want to keep my grade up for that class. Literally, it's only that class I'm worried about Spanish. And it's like not even my hardest class. It's just she weighs the assignments really heavily. And sometimes like if I don't get the assignment fully, she like take off points. Writing like a little script, but it has to rhyme. Little review session. So yeah, that's what I have to do. And then of course, editing. I'm actually gonna edit this video. But if you guys wanna see my planner, basically I have a weekly intention, be more mindful. I feel like I've done a pretty good job in some aspects, but I could improve in other aspects, I guess. Um, and basically I wrap my workouts, I highlight them in blue. So yesterday I had an absent arms day. Then I met with my human physiology group for literally an hour and a half, over that actually, trying to record our final project. So that's great. Um, so that took up most of my night and then I had to do like errands and stuff too and I did some driving practice. I'm just delaying doing my homework at this point. If you guys want, you can go follow my Spotify. I love listening to the classic Focus. Glasses. Like, I don't know where they are. Like, I literally looked for like two minutes and I was like, I'm giving up. And I ordered new ones. Like, that's so embarrassing for me. Anyways. Um, yeah, they're arriving today, so. <laughs> so here's my thing. Um, I'm not completely done, but literally I went off. Like, I did so much, so I have to edit this down a little bit. I just had some whole wheat street tacos and then ground beef, cilantro, and then I used yogurt as a substitute for sour cream. Greek yogurt is so good. And most Greek yogurt is lactose free. And it basically, since there's no flavor to it, it basically just tastes like sour cream. It's really good. Put some shredded butter lettuce, which is like my favorite lettuce. And then I ate that with some siete chips and salsa from my local grocery store. And that was delicious. Daily occurrence for me, as of recent, has been opening Amazon packages. Mm. Okay, so I'm just gonna 
Okay. It's in this nice little fancy black case. It's got a little bow. So I got these blue light glasses and they were uh, originally $20 for two pairs, but I got them half off. I don't even know, like there was some kind of sale. So literally $5 for each. And they come in these like plastic cases and they come with like glasses, cleaners. And these ones are just way smaller and like fit my face way better. So I really like them. So these are just clear. Ooh, these are so cute. Like they look so nice. I've been like on a glasses kick. I ordered um, another two pair of sunglasses. These are so cute. I will give you guys updates if I like them but basically now i'm just going to edit this video you guys are watching right now on my macbook i literally edited for like two minutes and then i went and grabbed this ginger peach sparkling water from the fridge this is just the target good and gather brand i added this little festive gingerbread man straw and we're gonna try it on camera Oh, it's like exploding out of the straw. Okay, I definitely cannot use a straw in here. Um, let's try that again. I think I need a second taste because that one, first one just like did not work out. So let's try it. I personally really like it because I like ginger. I feel like even though this is a finals week video, I don't seem nearly as stressed out as I was last week. Like last week, ironically, the week before finals week, I was way more stressed out because I had three essays due. I just wanted to let you guys know, you guys are not alone. I get so stressed out and anxious because of school, but you know, it's fine. I actually really enjoy doing school and like English, especially not really math. Recently, I've been obsessed with The Queen's Gambit and um, also Virgin River, which is like such a weird name, but it's basically like a Hallmark movie, but like, way better it's really good as well um there's definitely some cheesy parts dash and lily again that sounds so goofy like the show but it's actually so good so please go watch it um it's like a perfect like cozy christmas show um but queen's gambit definitely don't watch it if like you're under 13 because there's like some drugs and alcohol use in the show but tv shows for me are a great way to de-stress after like a night of finals Alright guys, so right now it's 11.30, which is later than I like to go to bed usually. I like to go to bed around 10, but sometimes it's just later. I just took some melatonin to help me sleep because for some reason I don't feel very tired. But right now I have my favorite Bath & Body Works candle lit, and then as you can see back there, just filled up my hydro flask. I'm going to finish getting prepped for bed. I just finish my skincare routine, brush my teeth, and yeah, now I'm going to go get into bed. So recently I found out I have mild hand eczema, so I got this Vanny Cream Moisturizing Ointment and this huge CeraVe Healing Ointment, and I just put this on my hands at night. Got my favorite Laneige Lip Sleepy Mask. I have my Harry Potter book. I'm currently on uh, The Deathly Hallows. Hope you guys enjoyed the video.